Hi and uh, welcome to Saints Talk. This is a weekly podcast that we're trying out to showcase the daily lives of our St. Andrews members, our Saints. Right? And so what's happening here is that we're doing a simple recording in the Brutal House and I have my Saints TV crew boys who are behind the camera. They are planning all this and they'll be doing all the editing in the background. I'm uh, not intending to be the host in the long run, but like I said, we're just trying to this first one out. I intend this show to be talking about what happens in school on a weekly basis, right? We have games that are going on, there might be special performances, announcements, uh, the concerned CCAs, academic materials, and uh, stuff like that. So that's, that's what I want this show to be about. So here we are trying the first one. Today is uh, obviously a uh, national day, so hopefully this can be posted up today itself. If you're watching this and today was national day, we have magically finished this video within one day. Uh, I have with me Pranav, who will be talking about National Day. But before that, I thought, you know, since we are going to talk about what's happening in St. Andrew's School, let's look at something that really caught my eye this week, right? This post, if you can see on the screen, was posted by the rugby teacher in charge, Mr. Aaron Kong. And he was posting up the scores of our C Day rugby games. And if you look at the numbers, they are pretty impressive. Every single game that we've played since early July, on the, on the 11th of July, we played. PSS, Pioneer Secondary School, I'm assuming, right? We beat them 87 to 7. And then we started beating everyone else. We beat RI 38 to 5, GSS 86 to 0, Evergreen 84 to 0, we beat ACSI 10 to 7. And ACS Barker 70 to 5, I mean, and SGI 52 to 0. RI, ACSI, ACS Barker, these are really, really good rugby schools, and I thought it was really, really impressive for our CDF boys to beat them at all these games. Now of course, in the Facebook, if you read, if you can read, the comments uh, start cautioning about being humble. Yeah, you know what, we could lose the next game. But you know what, I think that aside, it's fantastic that our CDF boys, our younger boys, Pranav and his classmates, are winning the hell out of these schools. It's, it's fantastic. So this is one of the few things that I want to talk about. Uh, today, we just, just want to quickly mention that I have here with me Pranav and Pranav will tell us more about himself and I'm going to ask him how he felt during National Day. Pranav, tell us more about yourself. Okay, so I'm of course in St. Andrews Secondary School. I'm from class 1A. Uh, actually, I think that the most, uh, it's a honor to be in RKS Adams class. And today as um, National Day, when I actually came late for school. So I actually missed the first few parts of the parade. But I still uh, tried my best to watch how the parade was going on. The uniform groups were splendid. I, I just couldn't, like, if I taught myself to be an NCC boy, I would have probably, like, flopped. Yeah, I, I couldn't have done as good as those students. They have been training for months, like, sec 4s, sec 3s, they were just wonderful. Like, it was really as if you went to a National Day Parade and you saw what was just happening there. It's it's really a proud moment where you actually get to like march and stuff like that. That's like once in a lifetime moment. It's really nice and yeah, I actually didn't like the National Day. We had many fun activities in class. Like uh, we got to like learn how to be kind. What actually most amazed me was the band when we went to the hall. We, they had a very good performance. The music was really nice. It actually made me like dance around the course I was sitting down, I couldn't do anything. Then the when one of the senior teachers talked about the boxing, I was kind of like enthusiastic to join the CCA but sadly I can only join after I go I become sec 3. So yeah, it's kind of it was very fun. We had an ending song of singing our home to Singapore and stuff like that. Uh, I found the whole, like, yeah, the whole timetable of today very interesting, very catchy for all the saints here. I could see that everybody was having a very fun time, and yeah, that that was what I think about National Day. Would you have rather have had classes or what do you think? Uh, okay, my opinion on National Day is that we could have extended the school time a bit longer. We could have had more fun if the school time was longer. We had more like programs to you know be active uh, active with, and yeah, 
That's what I think. That's cool. So do you think you'll attend National Day next year again, just like this? Yeah, most probably. That's cool. You know what? Pranav is great. I never really had to ask him any questions. We're running out of bit of time, so I'll cut the break now and we'll come back later and we'll talk about something else. Subscribe to our YouTube channel. This is uh, Shamir signing out. See you next week.